Time for a fun fact, guys. Do you know that in Uruguay, there's a place called Punta de Este. Now, Punta de Este is a very famous touristy place, and on its beach, it has a hand coming out of sand like this. Yes. And it is called Hombre, hombre Elegiendo para la Vida. It's like a man is trying to come out for life. It is actually made by a Chilean artist, and it is said that it has two meanings. One, that a man is surviving for life, life is important, and the other is the sea is actually warning you for its dangers as well. I hope you like the fun fact. If you are in Punta de Este, do look for a hand coming out of sand. Stay in tune. Beautiful folks, how are you? Welcome to the class. Today, we're going to learn something very important and which is sentence connectors. You know, it's like fillers. Whenever you want to be more ex expressive or want to emphasize on something and you want to be a little more artistic, so sentence connectors is your go-to thing. All right, folks, let's move on. The first one is en particular, means in particular. En otras palabras, means in other words. En contraste, in contrast. En consecuencia, consequently. En conclusión, in conclusion. En cambio, on the other hand. Debido a, means due to. Dado que, it's given that. Con todo, still. Todavía, still. Con el fin de, in order to. Aunque, although. Asimismo, similarly. Además, means moreover or besides. A pesar de, despite or in spite of. A causa de, due to. Ya que, because. También, is also. And, en primer lugar, means in the first place. Let's continue, folks. Sin embargo, means however. Respeto a, regarding. Puesto que, is given that. Por qué, means because. Por un lado, on one hand. Por último, lastly. Por otro lado, on the other hand. Por otra parte, also means on the other hand. Por lo tanto, therefore. Por el contrario, on the contrary. Por ejemplo, for example. Por consiguiente, therefore. Pero, but. Para empezar, to begin with. No obstante, nevertheless. Incluso, even. Finalmente, finally. Es decir, that is. En suma, in the end means in total. Well folks, that was about sentence characters and it is a very interesting and important part of any language and you will get more respect and more comfortable if you start using sentence characters. I hope you learned and enjoyed this session and if you wish to continue learning from me, please subscribe to my channel. Till the next session, take care, goodbye, ciao, ciao. Bueno mi gente, como esta? Espero que ha estudiado algo muy importante y espero que van a estudiar más con mi canal y así que hablamos junto. Y aprendemos con todo el idioma que se llama español. Bueno, hasta la próxima. Chao, chao.